with sport. Let's talk about the Olympics. I know Paris is just around the corner. I mean, it's many months away still, but still quite close. Uh, we're going to look even further ahead, though, to Los Angeles in 2028. Yes, that is when squash is going to make its debut as an Olympic sport. But while it might be a newcomer to the Games, it's an old favourite for very many, as Ruth Liptrot has been finding out. For this family, the news that squash has just been made an Olympic sport couldn't have come at a better time. Allow me to introduce the Maliks. Perry is 22 and ranked 90th in the world. Tori is 19 and ranked 74th. And 17-year-old twins Heston and Bailey are both in the top five in England under-19s. Oh, and then there's Curtis. He's ranked 51 in the world and isn't here today because he's been playing in the US Open. So how did he feel about the prospect of LA 2028? And yeah, it's uh, very good news for us. Like, you know, it's going to be about just under five years until it will, uh, will hopefully be going. Their dad is their coach and he's over the moon about it. This is something that I believe squash has needed for a long time, an injection of, um, you know, enthusiasm, an injection of, like, hope for people. And hopefully that will filter down into the grassroots. Make no mistake, this is a family that's super close, not least because the twins were originally triplets. They lost their brother Sumner to brain cancer five years ago. So they look after one another on and off the court. Yeah, obviously we want to beat one another because we're trying to push each other. But then again, like, uh, we're not really, like, training to beat each other, we're training to help each other beat other people. So who's the best player, though? Uh, the oldest brother, Curtis. <laughs> He's not here. But I'm the best girl. You're the best girl, are you? Because I'm the only girl. <laughs> but what about these two? Most tournaments, we always end up playing each other. It's always like a really, it's always a close match, so it's always quite tight. They can't both win, though, and when they were all young, things could get pretty feisty. There must be a bit of sibling rivalry behind the scenes. What are they really like? Yeah, no, that, that's true. Um, sibling rivalry needs taming, not <laughs> encouraging. Um, one of the things, when they were younger, I, half the time I spent trying to stop them killing each other almost on the court because they were so competitive. Now, though, they're all on Team Malik. They even have their own YouTube channel. If ever there's going to be a squash super brand, it has to be these guys. Watch out for them at the Olympics and probably on a billboard too with a massive sponsorship deal. See you in 2028. See you in 2028. Hopefully, yeah. Ruth Liptrot, 5 News.